Young Birds out at uh, Mission Bay today. Yes, and our friend Lauren Finney is out there. Um, and you're, you're telling us that they're pulling weeds, though. This is not what you would think of to do to save birds, pull weeds. They're creating a love nest. <laughs> that is right, as you were calling it earlier, Dan, inspiration point. It's inspiration uh, point. But <laughs> Mission, Mission Bay Park, actually um, a designated globally important bird area, and it's a place host to over 5,000 migratory birds, nine endangered species, and we are talking specifically about one endangered species, the California um, turn and the least turn and joining us now is Chris Redfern with um, the Audubon Society of San Diego and Chris tell us exactly what's going on today I know there are people hard at work and, and at nine o'clock we're actually gonna see over a hundred people out here pulling weeds or non-native plants that's right so we're partnering with SDG&E today and we'll also have some students from Point Loma Nazarene University and um, what you see behind you here is a designated least turn nesting site they're a federally listed endangered species so the city has set aside this um, site for them to come every summer to um, nest and rear their young. So um, the site needs to be prepared for them. Um, they need open ground and a low-growing vege native vegetation. So we're getting rid of um, the uh, extra weeds and tall plants to make it just the right sort of vegetation and habitat for them to be successful. And they're not coming until mid-April, but just so everybody knows what a California least turn looks like, we actually have a prop here. So go ahead and tell us about this. And I know we have a, an audio right, so, <laughs> as well. So this, this, is a, um, this is what the California least turn looks like. It's a small um, bird with a, a red bill and a black cap. And it has beautiful, um, wi um, beautiful wings and is a great acrobatic flyer. And it sounds like, like this, if I can get this going. Okay. Okay. So we need to create a nice area for them to breed out here. And um, this is your term, not mine, but there are chick condos out here. Explain that. That's right. So the roofing tiles out there, um, we use those um, to help protect the chicks from predators. So that one of the major problems with least terns and why they're endangered is they're, um, they have a lot of other birds that like to eat them. <laughs> so um, we use these, uh, these uh, roofing tiles um, as a way for them to hide. So we lay the roofing tiles down on the ground and the chicks can run underneath them and hide from predators when a predator comes. Chris Redfern, Executive Director of the San Diego Audubon Society, thank you for being out here and doing this. I know you guys are going to be out here from 9 to noon if you'd like to take part and help them kind of clean up this area, make it a romantic area for the birds. Um, but I didn't know as part of an endangered species you actually get a designated area for the birds to breed as well. So that's a great thing, and we appreciate you guys cleaning up here today. But we will send it back to you guys in the studio, Dan and Lisa. Um, you know, they're out here until noon if you guys want to take part. Lisa's Lisa is fascinated by that little squeaky bird. I know. I keep hearing it. It's a great sound effect. Can we hear it again? <laughs> Let's. See, they want to hear the bird again. <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, All right. Cute. That, those are good sounds. Very good. Yeah, sounds sweet. when you're out here at Mission Bay Park. That is a good thing. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Lauren. Thanks, guys. See you later. All right. Baseball.